So here we are, we're at uh, Laurier Street at Granville. And I'm looking south right there, that's all the traffic. So this is Granville down here. And we're gonna show you the reality of chemtrails. Look at this here. Okay, the trees are all dead at the top there. But we're gonna keep running down here and show you all the death. We're just at this uh, Lutheran uh, center here. There you go, it's all dead there. These trees are just a lot of yellowing, a lot of dead sections in there. And, oh my God, there's so many dead trees everywhere. Look at this here, the whole tree. Okay, these ones aren't dead, but this one is just suddenly dead, top to bottom, okay? So, let's see across the street, there's another one over here. Okay, there's that one up there. And this whole tree here is basically dead too. See, you can just see it's just got just a few twigs left and that's what it's doing all the way up. But that's nothing compared to what you're gonna see next. That's nothing, man. Check, oh, and look at these things. They're growing monstrous leaves. That's like twice as big as the biggest leaf you could ever get on this plant. So they're spraying a lot of strange stuff. And we're seeing it, uh, this guy's yard in the corner here. Every single hedge has died practically. There's probably a hundred little hedges on this guy's yard and they're all dead. And you tell me there's no problem? You know, believe me, that's what they tell the parents whose kids get you know, affected by the shots, they go, oh, don't worry about it, get out of here. Okay, and this is what they're trying to do to us now. So we're not gonna let them. Okay, look at this tree. It's just all dead. Okay, and you can see in there, more death and destruction in people's yards. We're just uh, blocked down now. We're gonna try to cross the street here. It's not looking too good, but definitely, Definitely we can see the, um, the destruction across the street here as well. You can see that. And the real worst one is this guy's yard here at uh, Granville and Balfour. On the northwest corner of the street, right there, okay? See those crows recognize. Uh, I guess I'm not from around here. <laughs> so, we're trying to cross, and we made it, and here we are, folks. What is going on here? Look at this. Look at this. All the trees are dead, okay? So it's time to speak up, people. It's time to speak up. Come on, put down your remote controls for a little while. Look at this, that whole tree there is ready to go. It's just all twigs, just a little bit left in the tip. And this one here, it's already dying. Probably they already chopped down half of it and that's what this gap is here. Oh my God, look at this. But this hedge is here. I've never seen anything like it. Look at them all. The whole guy's yard is finished. Just hedge after hedge after hedge, all dead. So many dead, anyways. You know, this is not normal. All the way into the corner here, we're seeing that. And then you could just see, just across the way here, look at the rest of his yard. This beautiful, majestic tree here, still surviving the chemtrails, but I don't know for how long. And uh, you could see it's just beautiful, but look at their hedges out here, okay? That just tells the whole story right there. And you could see that clearly. Okay, this is a nightmare, a nightmare. And this is all from the chemtrails. So it's not for the greater good. <laughs> oh my God, at all. All this is, and look at their holly tree. Again, it's just coming apart. All the leaves are falling off, they're yellow. They don't got no points on them, they're just smooth. Look at this. And this is all just happening right now. Okay, and we'll just take you back through now so you can see all the dead trees. 
just the whole entire place here is dead and dying. You can see all the way down through to there. The whole thing is dead. That's it. All this is dead here, what you're seeing. All this. This whole little section here. Okay? That's nuts. I've never seen it like this before ever in my life. You can just see these plants were burned and poisoned. That's all. This guy, and he's selling it too. Ellie Chan is selling the house that where the brunt of the poison falls on these people's property. So no wonder they're selling it because they don't want to be poisoned any longer. They realize it's just not safe to live in this area. Obviously, with all this poisoning going on, you know, who would want to live here? So we're seriously being poisoned. This is a fact. You can't hide the elephant in the room anymore. They're all dead, okay? And these look just like the statues at Broadway and Camby. And you're all gonna be dead too, okay? This side here, not exposed. Look at that. And there's still a little bit green on them. So all the way along, they're all burned. All of them. This is nuts. There's like a hundred of them. And they're all dead. They're all dead. Dead and dying. This one still has a bit of green down there. But essentially, you see what's happened. They're all dead from as far as the eye can see. So there you have it, Vancouver. It's not the green city. It's the most poisoned city I've ever seen. Get the hell out while you can, people. Honestly. Because this isn't going away anytime soon. Look at this thing. See? Dead pine trees in BC for no reason. Okay, I think we got enough footage.